for his eyes are upon the ways of man, and he seeth all his goings. There is no darkness, nor shadow of death, where the workers of iniquity may hide themselves. For he will not lay upon man more than right, that he should enter into judgment with God. He shall break in pieces mighty men without number, and set others in their stead. Therefore he knoweth their works, and he overturneth them in the night, so that they are destroyed. In the beast system, they have laws that protect certain groups of people. In a perfect world, the protected class status seems fair. When you apply for a job, the employer cannot discriminate against a candidate based on certain criteria. Everyone must have an equal opportunity. An employer cannot discriminate based on your race, gender, and many other features. We all know in the satanic beast system, discrimination happens every day. An important detail everyone needs to understand about the beast system, the kingdom of darkness want the beast system to appear as if it is helping the people. The help you receive from the beast system is an illusion to keep you in bondage. For example, the purpose of welfare is to disable you, not to help you. The kingdom of darkness want you to rely on the government for support. When the synagogue of Satan comprehend that you are dependent on their institutions and outreach organizations for care, you are no longer in control. In addition, you become powerless. The synagogue of Satan can treat you however way they choose and you have no choice but to comply with their every demand. The motive of the beast system is to destroy the people while making it appear as if the system is helping the people. For several generations, the kingdom of darkness have been chipping away at the power and dominion the Most High gave to his people. The scriptures reveal to us that in the beginning, Yah gave his people dominion on earth. God said, Let us make man in our image, after our likeness, and let them have dominion over the fish of the sea, and over the fowl of the air, and over the cattle, and over all the earth, and over every creeping thing that creepeth upon the earth. The Most High charged his creation to take care of the earth. Instead of taking care of the land, we handed the earth over to the kingdom of darkness. The scriptures reveal to us that the earth was given, not taken, but given into the hands of the wicked. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covereth the faces of the judges thereof. If not, where and who is he? Israelites, every time you refuse to take your place, notice I said take your place, not requesting to have your position back from the kingdom of darkness. You hand over your dominion and responsibilities to the kingdom of darkness. Every single one of us have responsibilities. Walking away from your responsibilities is not the answer. It is important that you understand if you do not step up, Satan will gladly take over. The Most High will allow the kingdom of darkness to rob you. The Israelite nation is a testimony to those who refuse to step up. When Eve was having a conversation with the serpent in the garden, if Adam would have stepped up and take control of the situation, just as the Most High command of him, life would have been different for us. Instead of taking his place and shutting down Satan, Adam participated in the rebellion and the earth was handed over to the kingdom of darkness. And the serpent said unto the woman, Ye shall not surely die, for God doth know that in the day ye eat thereof, then your eyes shall be opened, and ye shall be as gods, knowing good and evil. And when the woman saw that the tree was good for food, and that it was pleasant to the eyes, and a tree to be desired to make one wise. She took of the fruit thereof, and did eat, and gave also unto her husband with her, and he did eat. And unto Adam he said, Because thou hast hearkened unto the voice of thy wife, and hast eaten of the tree of which I commanded thee, saying, Thou shalt not eat of it. Cursed is the ground for thy sake. In sorrow, shalt thou eat of it all the days of thy life. 
Israelites, it is important to understand how critical it is to make good decisions every single day. The decisions you make affects multiple generations. The consequences to Adam and Eve's sin is in full effect until this generation. If your bloodline do not confess and repent, the Most High will punish the children for the sins of their fathers to the third and fourth generation. The Lord is long-suffering and of great mercy, forgiving iniquity and transgression, and by no means clearing the guilty, visiting the iniquity of the fathers upon the children unto the third and fourth generation. Generational curses stems from bad decisions. Sin turn into iniquity when it is not properly addressed. The iniquity travels through a bloodline until someone recognizes the sin. If no one step up and deal with the iniquity, a generational curse is in place. The decisions you make every day has consequences that affect your entire bloodline. Do not hand your decision making to the kingdom of darkness. Society has handed their rights to the beast system. The people became powerless when they allowed governments, satanic organizations, and religious establishments control their life. When we allow the beast system to control our lives, we give the kingdom of darkness dominion in the physical realm. It is through the beast system the kingdom of darkness gain control. It is important to the kingdom of darkness to make you believe the beast system is helping you. By doing this, the synagogue of Satan can strip you of all your rights. Israelites, it is important not to walk away from your responsibilities regardless of how hard life gets. The members of the synagogue of Satan that interfere with content creator's purpose is to discourage. If I allow their discouragement to cause me to stop, the people who are connected to this channel would be affected by my decision. Every day I have to make the decision to go on, regardless to their countless interference. Likewise, Israelites, every day you have to make decisions that will affect the people around you. You do not have the option to give up. The beast system is designed in a way that deceived the people into giving their rights away. The satanic corporations and organizations will create the problems, then give the people a solution to the problem it created. By doing this, the people believe they have a voice and their opinion matters. Behind the scene, the members of the protected class are organizing the deception. The voting system in America is prime example. The people believe they are the ones who put the president into office. The truth is the electoral college and the elite members of the synagogue of Satan determine who wins. The beast system programmed the people to believe their vote matters. The people who voted proudly display the sticker they received for participating. The people do not realize all they did was vote for the popular candidate. The popular vote do not determine the winner. Many people strongly believe their vote matters. Your vote do not matter. The members of the synagogue of Satan program the American people to believe they have all of these rights under the Constitution and many other man-made laws. Those who love their country believe their tax dollars entitled them to certain privileges. Many are now waking up to the fact that all of these so-called rights and freedom they thought they had was nothing but an illusion. If you say the wrong thing to an officer who is an elite member of the synagogue of Satan, that police officer may suddenly fear for his or her life and you will be dearly departed. If you say the wrong thing, they slander and discredit you in their media. Depending on how devastating the offense was, you may end up suffering from an accidental drug overdose. Caught up in a mass shooting, your doctor may prescribe you the wrong dosage. An accidental plane or car crash may be in your future. A sudden tragedy occurred to the offender or a family member of the offender. The same story, new victims. How much freedom do you really have? Many people do not mind the protected class status as long as they are on the receiving end of the protection. If the protected class or group status was truly for the people and made for the people, everyone would benefit from this protection. I believe there are seven categories that are recognized as the protected group or class. The list varies from state to state. Race is the top category in the protected class privilege. If race qualify a person for special protection, then everyone should benefit from the protected class status. Everyone belongs to a race. 
Unfortunately, the protection belonged to a certain groups of people. Remember, the beast system is designed to make you believe your leaders who run this world with Satan is there to help you while destroying you in the process. Israelites, there are two different protected class or group. You have to learn to differentiate. There is the protected class that supposedly benefit everyone from discrimination. Then there is the official protected class. In this group, all workers of iniquity benefit from this protection. Anyone who does the will of the kingdom of darkness benefit from the protected class status. As long as an individual does the will of the synagogue of Satan, further the beast system, the laws in the land that he or she dwell in will protect them. Today, there are certain elite groups that are under the protected class. Whenever a member of the protected class do not like what is being said, they will use their privilege to bully a person or try to destroy everything the person worked for. We are seeing this take place every day. The many changes to YouTube policies introduced me to the real protected class. Whenever YouTube remove videos, one of the few reasons they provide, they do not allow content that encourage hatred of another person or group of people based on their membership in a protected group. Whenever I read YouTube excuses for removing content, I ask myself two things. Is this the same protected group or class that is recognized by this nation that should benefit all people? Or is this a new tier of a protected group? I would ponder to myself, there is no way this protected group is the same with the standards. These people or group has a higher level of protection. I have seen content on the YouTube platform that spew hatred towards people who are protected under the seven recognized categories, yet the video remain on the site with a large amount of views. The moment anyone speak about a specific group of people, their content is removed and their channel is shadow banned. The groups that have a membership in this elite protected status that the beast system recognized must have a different membership from the rest of the population. Israelites, if you open your eyes, you will see everyone that does the will of the kingdom of darkness appear to be thriving. Do not let their so-called success fool you. These people are truly the walking dead. Behold, these are the ungodly who prosper in the world. They increase in riches. Verily, I have cleansed my heart in vain, and washed my hands in innocency. For all the day long have I been plagued and chastened every morning. If I say I will speak thus, behold, I should offend against the generation of thy children. When I thought to know this, it was too painful for me, until I went into the sanctuary of God. Then understood I their end. Surely thou didst set them in slippery places, thou castest them down into destruction. How are they brought into desolation as in a moment? They are utterly consumed with terrors. The alphabet community who has a high position in the kingdom of darkness protected group status, everything about their lifestyle goes against the most high. However, these people have the ability to have laws changed. Destroy the life of the people who choose not to participate in their lifestyle. Win awards for their heroic behavior. The beast system will protect them and elevate them. Anyone who promote the synagogue of Satan agenda will be promoted. Satan will not block you if you are doing his will. The kingdom of darkness will elevate you into an idol as long as you are pushing the kingdom of darkness. Many of our people in the industry and Hollywood have to act and sing the way the elite members of the synagogue of Satan tell them to if they want success. If they allow themselves to be used, they will find material success and some will receive the legend status. I do not know when our people will realize it never end well for legends. The so-called legends are one outburst away from an accidental death. The Israelite community is not excluded from the Kingdom of Darkness protected group status. Remember, the Tales videos is to help you differentiate what stems from the Most High and Satan's counterfeits. There are elite members in the protected group in the Hebrew Israelite community. These groups or individuals are the agents that were set up in the awakening by the synagogue of Satan to give the Kingdom of Darkness an opportunity to infiltrate the awakening. Through those agents, confusion and division plague the awakening. 
our people on the outside refuse to believe due to the false narrative planted by the synagogue of Satan in their media. In addition, the wicked behavior of the agents planted to disgrace the awakening. The satanic mainstream media always find the Hebrew Israelite agents to give a platform and for interviews. The federal government recognized protected class status is supposed to protect all people that fall under these groups. If you are a member of the Kingdom of Darkness protected group, whatever you do can override the federal recognized protected class. Religion is a protected class in the beast system. When the elite members of the kingdom of darkness protected class do not like certain scriptures that expose their agendas, these people are allowed to force their agenda upon the population and override whatever protection the religious establishments had under the so-called government protected class status. The members of the synagogue of Satan is allowed to persecute other groups. When the people fight back, everyone gets reprehended for attacking the members of the synagogue of Satan. Can you see how quickly you can lose your status under the federal government protection when dealing with the synagogue of Satan? Can you discern how the beast system make you feel protected? However, behind the scenes, they are destroying you. The converts that stole our identity do not like being called out for deceiving the world. They bribe satanic leaders to criminalize the innocent and victimize the criminals. These so-called chosen people of the kingdom of darkness go beyond measures to keep their privileges given to them by the kingdom of darkness. I know thy works and tribulation and poverty, but thou art rich. And I know the blasphemy of them which say they are Jews and are not. But are the synagogue of Satan. Stealing another group of people's culture and heritage is perfectly fine with the kingdom of darkness. Revealing truth is an abomination. The people who have yet to understand what is happening support the criminals. Most do not know any better because they are trapped in the beast system. The wicked mainstream media that does nothing but promote propaganda to its audience daily is rated E for everyone. While the FTC and other satanic organization wants to find ways to censor YouTubers. The satanic media wants to be the only voice without any opposition. The Most High is the creator of heaven and earth and everything belongs to the Most High. Yah has the final say. If the Most High choose to appoint his anointed to do his will, who can challenge him? The heavens are thine, the earth also is thine. As for the world and the fullness thereof, thou hast founded them. YouTube is now flooded with the members of the synagogue of Satan trying to steal views, audience, and concept from the original content creators. If those of us who are appointed and anointed by the Most High to do His will was in error, the kingdom of darkness would not try to use the members of its protected class to interfere. When the Most High is for you, who can be against you? Like the angels who rejoice when one sinner repent, I thank the Most High every single day for the awakening. Thousands upon thousands are waking up daily. Likewise, I say unto you, there is joy in the presence of the angels of God over one sinner that repenteth. There is nothing the synagogue of Satan can do to shut down what the Most High called to pass. Who can decree a thing and have it happen when the Most High did not give consent? Israelites, regardless of how big Satan wants to appear to be, greater is he that's in you than he that's in this world. Do not allow the beast system and the members of the kingdom of darkness protected class deceive you. Their time is short. The kingdom of darkness is doing whatever they can to prolong their time. The Most High is exposing the network that has been keeping his people bound for multiple generations in the physical realm. It is time to come out of the web that had many bound. Israelites, as your knowledge increase, trust the Most High and increase your faith. Now is the time to understand the physical realm you live in. Blessed are those who understand this message. Blessed are ye, when men shall revile you and persecute you, and shall say all manner of evil against you falsely, for my sake. Rejoice! and be exceeding glad for great is your reward in heaven for so persecuted they the prophets which were before you